People are freaking out over YouTuber PewDiePie's ISIS tweet. This is going to be interesting, let's take a quick look at the tweets. Oh. Oh no. I can't believe I'm delaying my next video for this pathetic fucking shit, but here we go. So I logged onto Twitter earlier, and what I saw could only be described as a BuzzFeed title. One company that will make you question humanity. Because this shit is beyond ridiculous, and it hurts my brain. So basically, this all started when, on the 30th of August, I made a simple tweet to PewDiePie. Why did you join ISIS? I can't believe it. I trusted you. Unverified. Because for some reason, Twitter apparently thinks that PewDiePie is a part of ISIS now or something. Anyway, I thought all was good. Maybe the half a person that hasn't muted me yet on Twitter may get a laugh out of it. Or they may just completely lose faith in me and block me. So after a couple of hours, I went to bed, I wake up and there's a notification. I looked at a notification and it's from someone I've never seen before. The notification was a screenshot by Markiplier's dog of Mashapore's article about PewDiePie making an ISIS joke and how fans are going crazy about it. And what is remaining of my faith in humanity quickly disappeared because they fucking took me seriously. Not Markiplier's dog of course, in fact they even publicly tweeted to say that I was obviously being sarcastic. Thank you by the way. Instead it was Mashable that took me seriously. It's fucking hilarious, they don't even need to put any research in to realise that I was clearly joking. It's like they just saw the word ISIS and ignored the fact that I apparently unverified PewDiePie. And when I looked at the article, there was only one other tweet where fans supposedly went crazy. There were no other tweets, there was nothing else to back up the story. There was just one tweet, one by me which is clearly fucking joking, and a second tweet which could probably be serious considering how Twitter's just as bad as Tumblr for easily offended people. I don't see how anyone can take Mashable seriously at this point, with articles such as 9 tricks to spice up your sexed life, and ugly Instagram is the only good thing left on the internet. Glad to see they themselves think they're not any good. Seriously, these articles could rival BuzzFeeds. This is seriously my legacy now, for fuck's sake. The only things I'm going to be remembered for is Thomas the Tank Engine doesn't want to set the world on fire, reading Do You Want to Play With My Balls Uncomfortably Close to the Mic, and now, as a guy who Mashable took too seriously. Honestly, I really doubt someone could actually be that stupid. Surely they couldn't find any actual tweets of people going crazy over PewDiePie's ISIS tweet and resorted to using tweets that are obviously jokes just so they can make some more money. Which is why I'm making this video, so I can earn that 0.000001 US dollar. Not really, I just felt like making a video on this because I was bored. One like and Mashable will take another tweet too seriously.